My friend today, not today, my friend over the weekend or whenever, he purchased a tripod with a, um, like it tracks, a tracking facial, whatever, 360, track you up, down, and center, and, uh, he bought this. I guess at Best Buy, and he sent, like, a lot of money on it, 100 and something, or close to $200, something like that, and having a uh, tripod capability to do that would be really cool, um, but I ain't trying to spend that kind of money, so I went on Amazon. To see if they had uh, a different, different one, you know, a different uh, tripod thing. There's a bunch. Sorry, white. Um, there's a bunch on there for way less. Where's my? I need a whisk. Hold on. Way less. Like. I think I saw one on there for 40 bucks. I did not purchase said um, tripod thing. Simply because I don't get paid for YouTube. So it's not that important to me. If I were to get paid from YouTube, my production value in my videos would skyrocket. Because I would get stuff to make better videos, you know, and I would have editing software and take time to actually care about the production value of my videos. But I have a regular job, and in that regular job, it does not require me to make videos. PowerPoints, sure. That's not a video, you know, it's not a YouTube video. I mean, I put a lot of veggies in here. It's mostly veggies. I can't show you because it will fall out. Okay. Put that there. But anyways, my point is he has a YouTube that he put gaming on mostly but he doesn't do anything else with it so why does he need this fancy contraption that's my question i have not asked him yet but he watches my videos so maybe he'll uh reply and and answer my question why did you spend so much money on something you probably won't use that much Oh, I missed some peppers and stuff. You get in there, you get cooked too. Yeah. Alright. So I was going to make just a regular omelet, but I put like a handful of them veggies in there, which is not bad. They're vegetables. Just uh, didn't make it better. Okay, well anyways, uh, let me cook this up. All right, so this is my, what would have been an omelet had I not added too many vegetables. Uh, so we'll just call it breakfast stir fry. It's not the warmest out, but it's okay. You know, it's still sunny. At least we got that going for us. We're going for our short walk around the block. Well, around the cul-de-sac or whatever we're doing right now. Me and Wyatt. Wyatt found a little treat. He was carrying it around, but he decided to put it down now. You gonna bring it with you? You can bring it with. Come on. There's a bone. Come on, good boy. Come on. I'm gonna take it home. <laughs> so funny. Oh, come on, 
on. Okay. Good enough. Good afternoon. It is 2.02. I am on my uh, second 15 minute break. This job has a lot of breaks. Get a 15, then you get your half, you get another 15. If you work 10 hour days, you get a 10 minute break after that. It's a lot of breaks. But I'm okay with that. If I was just doing customer service work, like on the phones and stuff, I would definitely uh, be, uh, you know, needing them breaks. Because customer service, it's a thankless job, let me tell you. Thankless job, customer service. All we're doing is trying to help the people. There's water all in my brush because of the doping. Anyway, we're just trying to help the people. And some of those people are Karens. I should glue this. That's what I should do. I should glue it shut. That way I wouldn't have to worry about any water going in or it breaking or whatever. I think that would be best. I'm like, I don't know why this comes apart. Does anybody know why? Because it's all gunky inside too. Like, what the heck? Okay. I'm thinking I will. I think I will take out my, um, what's it called? JJ, stop licking the toilet. No. What is it called? I'm gonna get that doggy no spray stuff. She won't, you know, eat things. I'll put it in the dumpster, in the dumpster, the garbage, garbages from the toilet. She'll leave it alone, you know. Anyway, what was I talking about? Work. Big breaks. Hairbrush. Yes, there's no point for it to be able to come apart. Didn't make any sense. So I think if I glue it, get my hot glue gun out. That's what I'm trying to say. Get my hot glue gun out, glue it together, then I won't have the problem. Um, yes, I do have other brushes I can use, but the one that I should be using for my damaged hair is this one, which you can see is the same exact thing. It's got the seam. Eventually, it'll rip open. I, haven't, I don't use this one very often. It's a lot less, like this one is... You can see this one's stiffer. That's what I'm trying to say. And the other one, while it does work, it doesn't detangle um, as well. I feel like it's maybe a little too weak, even for my bleached hair. But anyway, what am I trying to say? There's no point for it to be open the way it is. Makes no sense. So today, Alexa said it was supposed to rain today. There's no rain today. And in fact, she said it was supposed to be mostly cloudy and drizzles or something. But she said that yesterday and today it's like mostly sunny with no rain or anything so I don't know why she's not very accurate like where does she get her information from because um it's like it's fake news no it's just not accurate it's inaccurate so I think I'm gonna just start using the Google I need to set up my Google home still I'm gonna use that for um uh stuff. Use it for stuff. Weather. 
more accurate informations. And I still want to get my smart plugs to work. Um, so we get some smart plugs. Mama has her smart plugs, they work with her Alexa, they work with her smart plugs. And uh, um, she named her lights in her, yeah, she named the lights in her living room. Um, Leia, Luke, and Han. It's quite funny. My mom's a nerd, but in such a great way. You know, are there bad nerds? I don't think so. Everybody's a nerd in their own kind of way, you know. Like, people know about Star Wars, a lot of Star Wars stuff. Mom doesn't read the books or anything. I don't even know if she likes the movies, to be honest. I don't know. I've never really asked, but she must like them because she's got the lights named after them. Anyway. Alright, so... Um, yesterday I used the, uh... Actually, I didn't use anything yesterday because it was... Well, it was wash day and I should have washed my hair, but I didn't. I didn't wash my hair. <laughs> Oh Lord, excuse me. Anyway, uh, I used on Saturday. I used the the Aunt Jackie's Aunt Jackie's Curlala in my hair. Yeah, I squeegeed, squeegee my hair. Anyway, boring. He scared the crap out of me. Okay, so I have the balls that are in my sack. And um, these are dog balls. The dog balls are harder than like regular tennis balls. But here's the thing. Why it has the ball squishy, 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 right? Well, he uh, it broke this one. It's like cracked right here. It's got strong jaws, this one. Wyatt! 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 What are you doing? You digging? Hi. Hi. I got a ball. You want that? You get a ball? You get a ball? Come on. Here we go. Ready? So excited? What a ball. Go get it. He won't bring it back. Did you get it? You got it, Wyatt. Come on. See, he doesn't bring it back. So, yeah. You throw a ball with this one. It does not come back. He might, like, you know, carry it around. He might bring it inside, but he doesn't bring it back. No, he might be, maybe he's going to go bury it. I don't know. I don't know. He might. Is he pooping? No. <laughs> he's gonna, okay, he's laying down and chewing on the ball. All right. I guess that's what he's doing now. Well, he's ripping it up out here. See that? This dog ball is not a strong dog ball. Look at that. Already, it's like oh, it's a terrible ball. You get a regular tennis ball. He loves those because they don't rip up. But this one, look at that. This was just today. I just gave him this like a couple of hours ago, and this was just I just threw it. You saw it took him less than thirty seconds to tear up that ball. It's so gorgeous, how gorgeous. Gorgeous. I'm waiting on him. He's gonna come back inside or not? I don't know. Uh, it's nice enough to be out here, so I'm not mad at it. You know, it's not like morning, and I'm not like uh, blah, 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 blah. whatever. My grass is so green. At least where I have grass, anyway. It's 
There's no grass over there, so, you know, it just looks like dirt. And dirt and weeds or whatever. He's pooping! Yay! That's good because then he'll only have to like pee before we go to bed. I don't have to worry about him waking me up super early. Why? He's just like bolted to over here. Wyatt, you gotta come on this. Come on. Where you going? We go over here. Come on. You coming up? I don't have a ball or anything for you. Hey, Wyatt, come on. This is a good boy. This is a good boy. Let's go inside. Hey, good boy. Come on. Let's go inside and have a good boy. You'll have a good boy? Yeah. Where's a good boy? Okay, good boy. Yeah, we'll go inside. Okay. Oh, just don't scratch at the door. I'll get it. I'll get it. There you go. All right. Jay, Wyatt, what are you doing? You get a treat. Come on. Such a good boy. We'll get a treat now. We're going to get a treat. Mom subscribes to Chewy. So, got a big bag here. Well, a bag of food is in there. And his treats. We get you a treat? You want your treat? Okay. We get you a treat. I got it. Who's a good boy? That? Oh. You big. Sit up, up. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't jump. This good boy. Good boy. Shake. Okay. Good boy. There you go. That's a good boy. Do you know what I should make for supper? No, I'm literally asking because I have no idea. I don't know what I want. No idea. Could make some chicken. I don't really want to. We do have some stir fry. I don't want to make that either because I would make the chicken, add the chicken to the stir fry and have some chicken stir fry, which would be good, but I don't feel like doing it is the issue. You ever just brush your teeth and you're just like, smooth. I did. I did just brush my teeth. Thanks for asking. I'm not really sure. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do, you know. Hi, JJ. Hi. You got to, you can lay on Wyatt's bed. You've been doing that. Well, the one day you did. On Saturday. I'm not sure. I guess I'll figure it out later. It is 8.53. I just wanted to tell you the time. I am going to go to the bedroom. And I am going to lay down. Lie down. Lay down. Whatever. On the bed. As one does. In bedrooms I will uh, most likely just look at my phone and stuff that's on it like TikTok or Facebook and uh, and I will lie there and th and then I will become tired and then I will um, I will put my phone down and then I will go to sleep um, since it is only 9 a.m a.m. It's 9 p.m. Um, it is not time for me to sleep, but I will be going to rest and prepare my body for sleep. Tomorrow is Tuesday, so I'll see you tomorrow. Toodles.